what do you do when your car battery dies right so when the car battery dies your buttons will be unresponsive because the car cannot get any of the signals cannot process any of the signals that you're sending to it so when your car battery dies obviously without the key uh, the smart key will not work right and none of your doors will unlock the trunk is not gonna unlock which have shown flip your key over this flip it over you see this switch over here you want to push this away from the center push this away towards the edge like that and when you push that it releases this metal blade all right so release the metal blade and when you release the metal blade come here unlock and you know, I mean, with your battery dead, especially your car battery dead, this is not going to unlock the other doors. So you can do this, you can access this door, and if you need to access any of the rear doors, just reach in. Oh, obviously you need to reach all the way over there, but I'll go for this door over here. Okay, so in is locked, out is unlocked. Okay, so this allows you to get to at least your, your main keys your main seating area, your main uh, cabin. And but what if you need to get to the trunk, to the rear storage area, whatever you call it. So reach in there, unlock the car, and then over here, I'm gonna trip this. Again, remember, I cannot push the trunk button over there because the car battery is dead, right? So so to gain access to the back, just drop this seat, down it goes, and uh, well, to gain access to back there, I need to remove the net. Alright, probably need to bring the camera closer. Over here, to gain full access to the back, I'll need to crawl up into the car. Alright, so once you've uncomfortably made your way to the back, You'll notice there's three slots over here. One, well, three lines. One, two, three. But there's actually two slots. This one down here doesn't get you anywhere. This one here it takes you somewhere. This is where the trunk release is. So what I want to do is get this in here and push towards the right. I think the instructions tell you to get a tool in there and turn it 45 degrees or something like that. They tell you a suitable tool, so maybe it's a screwdriver, maybe not. I like to think that you should be able to fully access your car without needing any special tools, so we'll try using our handy dandy emergency blade. Get it in there and you can almost hear something, just listen out. There's something that kind of moves, all right? So, farm hand, do you hear that? Something moves in there, like it's spring-loaded. Okay, so I'll get a farm hand in there, or on there, and push towards the right. There you go. That's it. That's how you access your rear trunk area when your battery's dead. So let's bring it down. Why didn't they think of giving us handles, you know? That'd be nice. Thankfully, once it catches, so right now I'm just pushing at the top, once it catches, the automatic trunk should just pull down. Do you hear that? All right, that's it. So that's how you get around when your car battery is dead. All right, all the best. Let me get out of here. This place is so uncomfortable. But hey, that's what I do for love, man. I wanted to show you guys how everything worked. In case you found yourself in an emergency, at least you'd know what to do.